Hi there, it's Sandy Almock, and I'm going to do a little tech talk today about camera stands and phone stands. I've moved my workspace for filming over to the left now. It used to be in the center here. If you've seen pictures or videos of me filming, my space was about that big that where I'm pointing to. That was as large as the area was because everything on either side was encroaching on it. And now I've given over this entire left portion. And I did a deep clean down to the dust bunnies, sorted things, got everything cleaned out in the studio, really happy with it because I got this in the mail. Thank you to Erin from Archon for sending it to me to try out. I was nervous about it because it has a clamp on the end of it. They have a lot of clamp stands and I couldn't use a lot of them because of the way my desk is configured. I can't clamp anything onto the far side of a desk. My desk is attached to the wall. so. I was curious to see how this one would be, and I was ready to send it back if it didn't work out, but it did. The lady in the picture is showing you how most people will use it. Clamp it to the table that you're working on and point it toward yourself so the camera comes down right in front of you where you're working. I had to put mine on the side so it would come in toward the workspace. But this stand has tons of arms and hinges, and things that you can adjust with, which is really nice. The clamp itself even works on a very thin area. The part of the counter that sticks out is not very wide, and I was nervous that that was not even gonna be wide enough to hold, but it does. I've put my iPad onto the stand. The silver part is what telescopes upward, so I'm gonna be able to telescope up and get full paintings and it be able to include the palette and the water and everything. Very excited about that. There's another silver part that will telescope it out to the right. So it has lots and lots of options. What I used to use, and I now use with my phone exclusively, is this stand that has a base on it. Because I couldn't use any of the other clamp stands, I had to have the base. But in order to use this one with the DSLR, big heavy camera, I had to weight down that base so it wouldn't fall over which made it kind of permanent on my desk. It was a permanent fixture and I couldn't move it. But now I can use it for my phone for shooting short form videos like YouTube shorts and reels and TikToks, that kind of thing, which is really great. The elbows I can change to all different kinds of angles, do all sorts of fun things. And you can see here, if I have to sit it on the desk, which now I can do for fun when I'm gonna shoot something in particular, but if I have to sit it on the desk, I lose a good, what, eight inches, six, eight inches on the desk space. And that was not working for me when I was doing large pieces. And I can take this stand, I can just drop it onto the floor beside me, pull it back up if I need to shoot an angle on something, because sometimes when you're doing artwork, a different angle of a particular aspect will make a big difference. I've been working in this space now for about two weeks and I'm liking it. There's some little tweaks I'll be making, I think, over time but I'm still loving exactly how it's set up. The stand that you can see on the far side away from me is my microphone stand, which now I have right there in the middle of everything. So when I do live casts, when I do any of my voiceovers, it's right there in front of me. I just pull that out toward me and can start talking. The piece that I was working on was this little bird. I thought somebody was gonna ask, what is that gold thing you're working on? So there's a little peek at that. It's over on my fine art Instagram if you wanna see more of it. Since I am talking tech, I'll tell you a little bit about the lights as well. They're Draycast LED lights, and I had to buy separate stands and connectors for them so that they would stand up on the desk this way. I called b &H Photo and explained what I wanted, what I needed, and they kept recommending different things. And this is what I settled on after purchasing and returning a couple different things. And I've used these for a few years and I really do like them. This corner of the desk, also this is just a little bonus feature, is that little space underneath I can now put my knees under. Whereas before I was smashing my knees against the desk and kind of sitting like a frog in front of my desk if I was sitting on a chair. And now I can put them underneath on a box all propped up and comfy which is really nice. So if you need any stands from Archon, you can use my name, Sandy Alnock, for your coupon code to get 20% off. 
If you forget what the coupon code is or you forget where Archon is, it's always at the linked at the end of all of my videos at the very, very bottom. And sometimes you'll get linked to the DSLR stand going forward. The old videos, you might get linked to the stand with the base, but you can just go from there and use my coupon code to get yourself a deal. I will see you again very soon. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.